Sadly, the case of a missing three-year-old boy turned into a murder investigation. The body of three-year-old Daniel Theriot was found early this morning in a remote area near Lake Mead. The child's 20-year-old mother and her boyfriend are in jail right now. News 3's Gabby Hart looking into the investigation. Uh, yeah, that mother lived here at the Kensington Suites. Uh, police say she reported her toddler missing from Sunset Park, but they say things weren't adding up with her story. It turns out the toddler was never missing. Someone killed him and dumped his body. Oh my God, I just can't believe it. Oh my God. Just before nine Sunday morning, police say 20 year old Cassie Smith called 911, saying her three year old son, Daniel Theriot, went missing from Sunset Park. But after hours of searching and investigating, police became suspicious of her story. We started doubting if the three year old was actually ever at the park. At least 20 hours later, officers found Daniel's body in a remote area at Lake Mead. And Metro Homicide Detective Ray Spencer says there was nothing accidental about his death. We do have an idea of um, what we how we do believe the child was killed is um, I'm not going to put it out. I will tell you it was absolutely disturbing. When police went to the mother's residence at the Kensington Suites, they found her second child, a two year old with signs of physical abuse. Police arrested Smith and her 40 year old boyfriend, Joshua Oxford, for child abuse. Well, I'm glad they both got arrested and I hope they both rot in hell for what they did. Conrad Sutherland lives in the Kensington Suites. He says Daniel never seemed well taken care of and his mother often left him unattended and roamed the streets. She was the most responsible parent, but you can never see nothing like that coming. And now we're still waiting to figure out exactly how that child died. Police do say they believe he was dead for more than or at least 12 hours before his mother reported him missing. When the autopsy report is released, uh, murder charges could follow for this couple. I'm reporting live. Gabby Hart, News 3. All right, just devastating. You hate to hear this. Thank you so much.